Hello everyone, it's day 2 in Bali. So uh, in the morning, uh, we had our breakfast in the hotel. The breakfast was included in our package. So it was a spread of buffet. They had fruits, salads, cornflakes, and then a uh, few other items as well. And they asked us to order the main item to choose from their menu. So we chose um, pancakes and then my husband actually he chose some satay. So this was a very tasty pancake with strawberry topping and they gave us a pot of honey. It was so tasty. And then this is the satay made the satay with the lemongrass stick. They said it's satay lele. And then that's, that's, that was some sticky rice and some of the garnishing. After the breakfast, we hired a motorbike and we just wanted to go around the place to see because in the afternoon, our plan is to go to Ubud. So now we are going around the area of Legion where we stayed the first night. So, there were so many shops with clothes and all their uh, handmade items. So, we had a look on all those shops. Here we have come to a beach, a famous beach we went inside. This is actually the Kuta beach. It is so refreshing to be in the beach in the morning. So not so many people there but we just enjoyed a walk there. You can see the flight. So the airport is so nearby. The flight is landing there. These are some of the offerings you can see all over Bali in the mornings, in the afternoon, at the any time of the day. They say that we should not step on this and it will bring bad luck to us. So those who are going to Bali, make sure you walk carefully. And then we, uh, we are here in a painting shop. We just wanted to come and have a look at it. Those were so nicely painted and uh, Owner said those are all handmade paintings. Most of the shops they had handcrafts. Everything is so colorful, and you can see all the wind chambers here. And these are all made out of wood. I was kind of doing a window shopping or just a, just looking over the items there. Before we went to Ubud, we came here to have a food spa. The massage in Bali is very cheap comparatively and now we have booked a cab and we are on our way to Ubud. The places are so nice and we can see the richness of their culture in each and everything there. It was a one and a half hour drive from Legian to Ubud, uh, maybe because of the traffic, but those who are planning to stay in Ubud and come back to um, airport give at least two hours time for travel. And you can see all the places are so greenery and so cultural. We 
we are nearby our hotel and this is a very interesting place you can see so many birds flying over here and they said the, the name of the bird is kuku and many people come to watch these birds here so mainly around in the evening they, they said that we can watch more birds than in the morning because in the morning they fly away to the fields search of food so it was a nice sight to see there was around thousands of birds and there were so many people standing over the road to watch the birds. If you want to have a relaxing trip in Bali, Ubud would be the best place and now we have reached the hotel and we are entering into the hotel now. The hotel is actually in, in the middle of a paddy field so I hope this is going to be a very relaxing stay for us. We are now checking in into the hotel and the time is around 2 o'clock. They have got bikes for rental, so we are planning actually to get a bike for rent. You can see this nice Ganesha statue. This is all over Bali, wherever you go. <coughs> And now we are entering into our room. Let's see. We have some common swimming pools. So both the sides of our room is a swimming pool. Let's get inside. So this is our room. They have got a cabinet or a wardrobe. And this is our bathroom. Actually, they have a bath and then they have a shower as well. After resting for a while, we decided to go to Ubud Central. Now we are at Ubud Central. Um, we are in the Ubud Central Market. Let's go inside and see what are the things available. It's so colourful and so nice. Everything is colourful and with ancient looks. You can see the wooden sculptures, wooden um, kitchen utensils we should be good at bargaining when we are here at this market
They said this market will be closing at 6 o'clock but now it's around 6.30 still they haven't started closing yet. There are so many people and we bought some ornaments. I would say these people are so creative and so imaginative in their work and they are mostly us, mostly skilled. And this is a very special um, place we visited. You will have a separate video on this um, coffee shop. You can click the link above there in the screen and to go to the full video of this coffee shop. We had a nice coffee and also we had a chance to play with the animal. We are now at the Ubud Palace waiting for a cultural event. So before the cultural dance starts, let's go inside the palace and see. This is the front part of the palace and we heard that still the generations of the king, they are living at the back of this palace and this is for the viewing of tourists and visitors. So it was a very nice place. Of course, the palace would be a very nice place to visit. I think they are taking some offering or after prayer, they are taking something into the palace. So people are there sitting, relaxing. This is free of charge to get into this part of the palace. And we are waiting for the cultural dance. The cultural dance was so nice. We spent around one and a half hours there. We will be adding a separate video on the cultural dance as well. After the dance session, we thought of having our dinner and we found nasi padang. Nasi padang is a famous Indonesian dish. Padang is an area uh, at the coastal part of Indonesia. So it's always cooked and ready. We just have to assemble according to our wish. There are so many dishes to select. It's a very traditional and a very tasty dish. You can see the spread of food with more sambal on the chicken. So we ordered some chicken, fish and some brinjal. It was a very tasty and traditional food. I would say we really enjoyed it. So the day two ended with this kind of an Indonesian dinner. Let me meet you with another interesting uh, video. Thank you.